Are you ready for raw speed? Raw speed. Some real speed. Some real speed. That was a love, that was a love, that was just hope. Ooh, 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 ooh. Good morning, everybody. So I have a theory, really a train of thought, to run by everybody. I've been, I've been thinking about this because a couple of days ago, I posted a video of Ali swimming in, in our endless pool at home doing breaststroke. Yeah, if you didn't know, Allie is also a breaststroker, a pretty, pretty good breaststroker. She was a swimmer, she swam her whole life, and she also coaches. And I am also a breaststroker, a, a pretty good breaststroker. I mean, thank you. Temperature check, nailed it. Mr. Long has some important information that I need. What's my, uh, what's my order of events today? You got this guy on top of it. Okay. Followed by four by 100 medley relay. Okay. We'll have Zach out leading you off. Okay. You'll be number two, then we'll have Iago, and Blake to bring us home. Yeah, right, just doing what I'm told. As I was saying earlier, Ali and I are both breaststrokers, so does that mean that my son will also be a breaststroker? Because, you know, if you have dark hair, and your wife has dark hair, and you make a baby, that baby's way more likely to have dark hair. Like, that's just science. I don't understand it, but that's kind of how it works. Oh, I got hair in my goggle. It's Ew. the worst. <laughs> you ever do that? No. It's the worst. I've so the got hair in my goggle. So the question is, will my baby also be a breaststroker? No. You don't think so? My mom is a backstroker. Yeah? My dad can't swim to save himself. My but don't you think? But my brother's a backstroker. But don't you but think? I'm a breaststroker. But don't you think that the, the fact that I'm a breaststroker and Allie's a breaststroker makes it more likely that my kid will also be a breaststroker? I don't know. Or does it not? Does it not work that way? I'm not sure. I Science works been, genetically. I also might have been dropped on my head as a child, so maybe that's why I'm a breaststroker. Facts. I don't know. Though. Laura is ready to have a great set. No, it's gonna be a good one. Except everyone on Instagram was worried where Cody was on the paper. It's the army. They're, they're there for me. Oh, they support you. <laughs> so there's a wager on today's race. It's Blake's Tuner Freestyle. I don't know the exact time he has to go, but if he goes the time, both Corey, whoever called Corey on there, and then John Long, this this guy right here, has to do a Tuner Free all, is that the bet? That is the bet. That's the bet, so if, the time, if sure the time is what's right. the time? 133.2. Oh, what, it got faster? He kept saying 133. Oh my gosh. I never agreed to that. Okay, so if 33.2. If Blake goes 133.2 in the tuner free, which is like borderline impossible, crazy fast, <laughs> then both coaches have to do an, a tuner free for time as well. John, do you think this is going to happen? It, it's guaranteed. He's going to do it. Coach John is this, gonna have to do. This is the stuff that fires up Blake Peroni. This is the stuff of champions. John, John seems to think that it's a guarantee that you're gonna hit this. I believe in you. I want to see it. Make sure you time me. Time you. Okay. Stop the watch whenever. <laughs> just, see 132. Nine. Just stop the watch. Regardless of where I am. Okay. You get a 132. John gets 136. It won't matter. Yeah. Yeah. It will win. You're overriding. We got this. Okay. So here it is. Here's the sheet. Oh, my hand is shaking. Gosh. The caffeine. So there I am, hunter breast, relay, hunter breast, hunter fly. I did not make this up, I'm just doing what I'm told. I'm gonna jump in your lane, Lily, and then corkscrew under the lane line into my lane with Laura. Okay. Yeah! Oh, best part of the day. Best part of the day, Yusuf. Yes, it is. Yes. Got my Captain America suit on. I'm ready to roll. Thank you. 
Good job. That's solid. Now for the showdown. Hey, impressive first effort on the lactate set. That, that, that was Cody Miller's first lactate effort since the summer. And to go 51-9 out of the gate was, was awesome. Yusuf, big improvement for him at 55-1. And then Lily, um, I thought she had a shot to go 56, but going 57-4 is not too bad in full training. But I really think if she kept the pedal to the metal on the third 25, she goes 56. Forty-five one to the foot. I need a bit strong back half. Yeah, forty-five one. Give Zach half. Come on, Blake, get it! I want to see it. Yeah, go! Come on, yeah. There we go. There's the ball. Come on, yeah. Go, Blake, go! I'm nervous. I'm nervous. <laughs> Ooh. Zach's on his first 100 free right now. Last 25. Here we go. Come on, Zach. Come on. Get it, Zach. Get it. Go, Zach. Go. God, look at that straight arm. John had 42-0. Ray had 41-9. <laughs> Where do you give it to him? All right. We're relay here. Zach Apple leading us off. Going off the of grievance, right? Going off the grievance is the hardest thing. Yes, it is. This looks pretty fluid. Oh no. Go Blake! Yep. Go! Oh boy. You got the That was a little bit slower. I let the team down. Woo! Oh, pain green there. 42 8. 3 11 1. Oh! Alright, I gotta add three efforts for that. Oh. So I got roped into doing skins with Lily. 350s on what's the minute? Three, three minutes on rest. three minutes rest. That's what I do. This is 50 number two. I got back down. Well, we did it. Fast hundreds, fast fifties. Lots of lactic in my body. Lactic acid. Can't even speak right now. It's time for me to go home and love on my fur balls. Ooh. I'm home. Hi, Puff. We had a good practice today. Not a bad way to start the day. Some pretty fast swims. That was a lot of fun. Those are some of the most fun practices. Good morning, Lego. Hi. So now that our baby is about to come, my mom has been sending me boxes of old stuff that's just been in storage at her house because uh, she recently moved and like needs to get rid of stuff. And she sent me some, some cool stuff. Here, look, look at this. <coughs> it's a little bit of a disaster in my kitchen right now. I've got all these old photos from when I was little that I haven't seen in years. My mom found this old photo of all four generations of the men on my dad's side of the family. My dad on the left, there's me holding a little stuffed animal, my grandpa, and then on the very right, that's my great grandpa Ping. He lived to be over a hundred years old. I remember I was like, 
maybe seven years old at his hundred year old birthday party. Like I just like saw some of these photos and had like a flood of memories. Oh my God, some old middle school photos. That's me in seventh grade. Look at that little smile. I think I should bring back the buzz cut with the spiky hair. Look at that. This was one of my first memories of when I moved to Las Vegas. Um, that's me and my dad on top of the stratosphere riding what was the roller coaster. Now there's different rides on top, but there used to be a roller coaster and I remember driving through the 95 through Las Vegas seeing the stratosphere for the very first time and being like, oh my God, that's amazing. Like I wanted to ride it so bad. May of 2001, so just a couple months after 9-11, we moved to Vegas. I'm taking a trip down memory nostalgia lane. <laughs> I found some of my high school report cards from sophomore year. As you can see, I did get an F on my geometry exam. I uh, explicitly remember skipping geometry. I cut class like way too much to go to my friend Jake's house and play video games and and I learned pretty quickly that I was just too stupid to do that and I couldn't I couldn't not go to class. Here's one of my first swimming all-American honors. I don't even really know what this means, but I remember getting a little certificate and a plaque at like the yearly team banquet was like a really big deal. I felt cool and special that I was getting an award for, for doing something. And this is one of my favorite things, the Panther print. This was our school newspaper, 2007. So nine years before I made the Olympics. There's some pretty funny quotes in here. My next step on the road to making the Olympics is I need to make the US nationals it's about a 2.5 second drop from my best time in the tuner breast right now. That's a totally staged photo of me drinking out of a bottle. <laughs> anyway, seeing some of this stuff has kind of made me laugh. Now that I'm about to have a son, this kind of makes me like reflect and look back at all of these old swimming and high school memories and you know stuff that really doesn't feel like that long ago. Like it doesn't feel like this story in the high school newspaper doesn't feel like it was that long ago. That's what's crazy. <sighs> Thank you, Mom, for sending me this box. Here's my old baby blanket. I had this when I was a little kid. I think my grandma knitted this for me. I appreciate you sending that stuff to me, Mom. I love you. Thank you. And now it's time for me to make a little bit of diaper money. Ugh. Today's video is sponsored by Squarespace. And really, really cool, last week I did a video also sponsored by Squarespace, and I had, just a couple days later, I had four different viewers reach out to me and share with me that they had started blogs. Three swimmers and one coach that watched my videos were all thinking about starting a blog revolving around swimming, and because I promoted Squarespace, they decided to use that platform to start their blog, and I think that that's really cool. Squarespace is a website builder that allows you to build your own personalized website for whatever your need is, but it's more than that. If you're a small business, Squarespace can help you set up email campaigns and sell products or services on a weekly or monthly basis. I've highlighted this tool before because it's one of my favorite elements of the Squarespace platform, and that's the social media integration aspect. Squarespace authenticates all of your social profiles and then seamlessly posts everything together as you've scheduled to do so, which is really great when it comes to building a brand and, and getting something out there. If you're interested, head to squarespace.com to start your free trial. And when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash Cody Miller and use my promo code Cody Miller to get 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Make sure you guys are following me on social media at swimmiller on Twitter and at Cody Miller on Instagram. Vlogs every Wednesdays and sometimes Fridays. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and share my videos with your friends. That really helps me. We have merch on the merch store. If you're interested in that, go check that stuff out. And until my next video, I will see you guys later. Ooh.